U.S. announcement of sixth generation F-47 fighter draws analyses from Chinese experts. The U.S. recent announcement of the F-47 fighter jet has drawn intensive analyses from Chinese military affairs experts and observers who acknowledge the aircraft being a real sixth generation fighter jet for featuring typical characteristics such as a tailless design. But they also raise questions over its potentially limited stealth capability, relatively small size, and the U.S. election of Boeing to build the warplane. The Pentagon has awarded the contract for the U.S. Air Force's next generation air dominance future fighter jet, known as NG-80. To Boeing, U.S. President Donald Trump announced Friday. U.S. news outlet Defense News reported on Saturday. The sixth generation fighter, which will replace the F-22 Raptor, will be designated the F-47, Trump said. It will have state-of-the-art stealth technologies, making it a virtually unseeable, and will fly alongside multiple autonomous drone wingmen, known as collaborative combat aircraft, Defense News reported. After reviewing the artist renderings of the F-47 released by the U.S. Air Force, Zhang Xiefeng, a Chinese military affairs expert, told the Global Times on Sunday that the F-47's appearance conforms to the general development trend of the sixth generation fighter jet concept. For example, it does not feature any vertical tails, which is an attempt to further improve its stealth capability in all directions. It has a flat nose and a lifting body fuselage. These are all important characteristics of a sixth generation fighter jet. Zhang added that man-on-man -man teaming is a core sixth generation feature and one the F-47 includes. However, a pair of canards can be observed in front of the F-47's main wings, and this will more or less impact the aircraft stealth, Jean noted, reiterating that an important trend for sixth-generation fighter jets is to remove vertical tails and use a supersonic flying wing configuration to boost stealth. Jean said that new mechanisms are needed to act in place of vertical tails to control the aircraft, such as movable wingtip. But the F-47 opted to use canards, a relatively old technology often found on previous generations of aircraft. He suggested Boeing may lack the tech base to develop new control methods and relies on outdated design choices. In December 2024, videos and photos emerged on social media, allegedly showing two types of aircraft with new designs had conducted test flights in China. Despite no official announcements, many call them China's sixth generation fighter jets. Both of them appear to have removed vertical tails and also do not have canards. One of them, resembling a ginkgo leaf in appearance, looked far larger than its J-20 Escort. Wang Yanan, chief editor of Beijing-based Aerospace Knowledge magazine, told the Global Times on Sunday that comparing with the size of the canopy and the front landing gear, it can be analyzed that the overall size of the F-47 is not likely much larger than the F-22. It means that the F-47 is still a tactical aircraft rather than a large, multipurpose aerial platform capable of conducting campaign-scale missions like the Ginkgo Leaf aircraft. Defense News, citing Air Force Chief General Alvin, claimed that experimental versions of the NG-80 have been flying for the last five years. But Wong noted that there is no proof of this. Even the pictures depicting the F-47 are artist renderings rather than photos. Wang also noted that Boeing has not won a major fighter jet program for decades. Its F-15 and F-A-18 fighter jets are from McDonnell Douglas, which was merged into Boeing, and Boeing's Onex 32 fighter jet lost the F-35 from Lockheed Martin in bidding. Boeing's other projects, such as the 737 MAX airliner and KC-46 tanker aircraft, also encountered many issues recently. Having a company like this to lead a sixth generation program is actually very risky, he said, in addition to U.S. NG-80 program. Other countries are also developing sixth generation fighter jets. France, Germany, and Spain are in the future combat air system program to develop a sixth generation fighter jet, while the U.K., Italy, and Japan have a sixth generation global combat air program fighter project, according to Defense News. Russia's sixth generation efforts have also surfaced in task reports. Wong said the U.S. is moving fastest with the F-47, while other nations lag. With China's own jets already spotted in the sky, the outside world is now seeing China and the U.S. in advanced stages of sixth generation fighter jet development.